not I love him, though yet I ask for him. Tis but a peevish boy. Yet he talks well. well. What care I for words? Well, words do well when he that speaketh them pleaseth those that hear. It is a pretty youth. Not very pretty. But sure he's proud. And yet his pride becomes him. He'll make a proper man. The best thing in him is his complexion. And faster than his tongue did make offense, his eye did heal it up. He's not very tall. Yet for his years he's tall. His leg is but so-so. And yet tis well. There was a pretty redness in his lip. A little riper and more lusty red than that mixed in his cheek. It was just the difference between mingled red and constant damage. There be some women, Phoebe, had they marked him in parcels as you had, would have gone near to fall in love with but him. For my part, I love him not. Nor hate him not. And yet I have more cause to hate him than to love him. For what had he to do to chide at me? He said, mine eye was black and mine hair black. Now that I remember it, scorned it. I marvel why you answered him not again. Omittance is no quittance. I'll write to him a very taunting letter, and thou wilt bear it. Wilt thou? <laughs> <laughs>